And now to the fight against COVID tonight. The CDC is recommending people use the most protective mask they can, including N95s to slow the spread of the Omicron variant. This comes as Americans scramble to find testing kits. CBS 13's Michael George has the latest. With the Omicron variant on the move, a new ban on large gatherings is in effect in Northern California, Sonoma County. It's definitely a here we go again kind of feeling. This does seem the Omicron seems like it's going to be gone quickly. Uh, we just hope there's nothing behind it. Experts like Ali Makdad of the University of Washington remain on alert for other COVID strains on the horizon. But for now, Omicron is crowding out the field. Omicron is not allowing anything else to to spread. Meanwhile, the CDC is offering new guidance on masks that offer the best protection. I know we all wish that we could finally be done with wearing masks. I get it. But they're, they're a really important tool. On its website, the CDC says loosely woven cloth masks provide the least protection and well-fitting respirators, including N95s, offer the most. This Miami area company is operating 24 7 as it makes some 5 million masks a day. We have the ability to take it from our production line and ship it within minutes. We don't have to import it from any other country. And to combat long testing lines and a shortage of rapid test kits, the Biden administration is launching a website that will take orders for up to four per home at no cost. The site goes live on Wednesday, but the test could take more than a week to ship. The head of the World Health Organization says he'd like to see 70% of people in every country vaccinated by mid-year in order to stop future variants from developing. 